Uncle, I know that this land belongs to you. But if you enter here to claim it, you'll be a dead person. Any of your children that will enter here to claim it will be dead. Thunder will fire them. And any member of your family that enters here, that person will be dead. Oh, Oh, Now you're for. What are you doing here? Eh? Hey, so, you're burying Talisman for Okumpo and his family, eh? Who told you that? Who told you hey, that? What are you doing? Tell me, what are you doing? Listen, if you tell anybody of this thing, if you tell them... Then you do what? You will die. Ah! Hey, yes. Don't worry. I know what I will do. I will go right now to Okumpo's family and tell them what you're doing here. If you try it, you'll be a dead person. We shall see. Foolish yes, girl. Yes, man. We can't get rich. Take it easy. except to deposit the sum of 10,000 Naira. You see, she cannot deliver normally except through a cesarean section. So go look for the deposit. Please. Well, she's alive now. Yes. Please, I don't have such money now, doctor. I will pay you everything later, but please send my baby and my wife. Okay. Please, I don't have much time to waste. And the earlier you get the money, the better for you. So, I'm going to excuse me, okay? See, and the doctor said she will undergo a cesarean operation because she's under, 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 under level, brother. And the worst is that I have to deposit 10,000 naira before they will touch her. Huh? And if, like you know now, for the past half months, the local government have not paid us. The little money I have, I use it on my wife during this pregnancy. The remaining one I use to repair my bicycle. Nothing, not even cover with me, brother. Hence, I have you. I have hope. Oh, it's not sake, brother. You are very stupid. Huh? I warned you when you were going to marry that woman. I said, you should not marry her that she is evil. You wouldn't listen. You've gone and married her. Now you are suffering. You have the courage to come to me to lend you money to save a witch and that evil she's carrying in her womb. Well, my wife is not evil. She's not a witch. Uh, my wife is, with my own degree, is not a witch. And my child is not evil. Uh, yeah. Is it because I have this problem? Look, brother. You are my last resort, the last hope I have. Can you help me? She must not die now. Oh! Oh! Please, please. Isuna! For God's sake, just help me. You she don't want the witch to die. She's not the witch. But, but you will die. die. Eh? You want to die yourself. Uh, right. Right. Don't worry, I'll help you. Thank you. Wait for me. Thank you. Wait for me. I was coming to your office. Yes, I sent for you. How is that woman? Isuna's wife. 
Oh, the woman is still there. She's still lying down there. Lying down there? Yes, doctor. What of the husband? Has he come? No, we are still waiting for him to come. Waiting for him? Yes, doctor. Now, for how long do we still have to wait for him? How long? I'm asking you. This man brought his wife in here and for over three hours he said he was coming and we're still waiting for him. Anyway, I know what to do. I think I should ask that woman to leave this hospital before she dies here no. since the husband does not want to come No, back. doctor, you don't have to do this. You don't have to do it. This woman's condition is very bad. She needs help. Please, doctor. Please. And how does this concern me, nurse? I know, doctor. I know, doctor. But you have to do something. Do something, please. Do something. Do something like what, Miss Nurse Do Good? Something like what I'm asking you. Good. Please, Doctor, eh? in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, eh? do the operation while we still wait for the husband to come. I believe he is out there looking for money. And supposing he comes in here and he hasn't got the money on him, how do I recoup my money back? Have you thought of that? Get away from here, you're not serious. But, doctor, please wait. Eh? If the husband doesn't pay, Collect it from my salary, please. Mm -hmm. You're serious? I'm serious. Your salary? Yes, my salary. You mean that? Yes, I mean it. It's all right. Go get the theater ready for the operation. Thank you very much, Dr. Mm -hmm. Thank you. All right. Hello? Hello? Ah, who is that? Oh, it's Luna. You have come. So soon. I walk around and said that Laro Laro. Ah, so these are the goods. These are the goods. Ah. Can see how ready. Hello. Okay. Um, it's Runa. Uh, I have seen the goods. Naturally, you know I don't need them. But since you said that you want to sell them to save your wife's life, I will give you 7,000 naira. You know, you are one of my kinsmen. That's why I'm giving you these 7,000. Otherwise, I would have bought them. Or one thousand each. I just want to help you out. Why, 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 why are you saying that? Oh, so good. If only Bolivia had been using it, but at least consider it. These goods are all pregnant goods. Each of them cannot be sold for less than six thousand naira or even more in the market, and they are pricing all of them seven thousand naira. I ask you to give me ten thousand. That is what the doctor demands for as deposit. Huh? I just want to save my wife's life. You talk too much. Let me come. Um, is it Let me keep this one for myself. As a family man, you know what it means. Sure. Hey, what time you going to see? So why are you doing this now? How will I make it up? I told you the doctor demands for 10,000 naira. How do I get the remaining 2,000 to complete it up? Where will you get the 2,000? Yes, now. Uh, huh? Let me think. Why well, I have a brother like you should, you should make it up. 2,000 naira. <laughs> Uh, maybe you should bring me more two goods so that I will give you two thousand naira to complete it ten thousand. I should bring more two goods for you to buy one thousand. I'm doing it because I want to help you. Okay, let me go first. Ah, uh, where are you going? This is the main gate. That's the gate to the backyard. This is the main gate. Ah, uh, whoa. poverty is a cause. Ah, uh, it's Una. When I bring in the many two goods. Have I offended you? Is you not? Anyway. <laughs> 
This good. This if I take this one to the market, I will sell the seven thousand thousand each. Times ten to one thousand. Hey! Hey, we! I'm going to go to the market. I saw you are brother is in uh, entering my studio philosophy house, holding three goods. Okay. I hope there's no problem. Uh, no problem. Maybe he wants to sell them. <laughs> sell them? Why? Why? I don't know. Eh? He came here this morning telling me that his wife was admitted in the hospital and that he needed some 10,000 naira to enable them to carry out a cesarean operation upon her because she's under labor and the doctor needed that money. Well, I told him that I don't have that kind of money. Oh, for why? What do you mean, why? Oh, for do you mean to tell me that uh, your brother's wife is having such a problem? I came to you. You refused to help me out, oh, for. That is wickedness, oh, for. Okay, the guy you mad. Is anything wrong with you? Were you not there when he wanted to marry that witch? Uh -huh. And I objected to it. I told him that that girl was a witch. That he should not marry her and he went ahead and married her. Now they are having problems and you are asking me, why you, what is wrong? What is your business? Huh? Mm -hmm. Your brother said he loves the woman. Mm -hmm. Then what is your headache? Are you the one marrying her? Offer? Mm -hmm. Yes. Offer? Uh, okay, okay. uh -huh. How many times have I called you? Offer? How many times did I answer you? Go and look for your brother and help him. Okay, okay. something must be wrong with you. I offer to go and look for Isuna and help him. Yes. That will be over my dead body. I will not help him. Listen. If anything happens to any of them, mm -hmm. I will make sure that you answer query before our kinsmen. Uh, Okadike, are you leaving me? Why are you walking so fast? Aren't uh, we going together again? Uh, it's your, that is your business. Uh, we, are, we are no more going together. Uh, uh, it's okay. I don't blame you. I will go. I'm attending the meeting in Kuali. Nonsense. Oh, you think anybody can ask me to go away from that meeting? That is rubbish. Nobody will do it. Uh, on getting to Okazi T Junction. Uh, this man will just looking or even even breaking, just running to the middle of the junction. And before I could know it, my car just knocked him down. That was all. And you killed him. You killed him. Do you know that you by the very act of killing this man had created a, a situation here, a double problem here. This man's wife just delivered a baby boy. And this man went scouting for money for which he would just use as a deposit. And what did you do? You killed him. What becomes of the child? What becomes of the mother? What about the family? And for God's sake, who pays the bills? Tell me, who pays the bills? Jose, okay, doctor, please, calm down, calm down. Uh, I'm going to take care of the hospital and tell him, yes, I will even bury him according to our culture. 
I will also take care of the boy and his mother. Hunting groups, we will do it. No. You will do that? Exactly. Anyway, before any other thing, you know we have to uh, inform the police. This is quite a serious case, except of course the family would want to make a case out of it. Mm -hmm. Please, doctor, before that of police, eh? can you help me? Let's go and see his people. Uh, yes. uh, Mr. Mike, you know it's not as easy as you think, mm -hmm. but I suggest first let's go see the wife. Hmm? Don't worry, work things mm -hmm. out. Hmm? Okay. Work things out. Mm -hmm. That's it. She's the wife. For now she's on drugs and cannot wake up until late in the night or maybe tomorrow morning. And you what's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with your stomach? Nurse! Come over here. Hurry up, for God's sake. You left her lying here, you didn't give her no attention. Make sure you give us my algae injections, okay? Now hold her a while so that he subsides, okay? Be smart over there. Very smart, please. Come on. Doctor, please. Doctor, please excuse me. What can I do for you? Yeah. Doctor, please, I want you to help me and see this people. Please. Are you, are you joking? Now, do you not appreciate my position here as a medical director? How do I leave my patients and take it to God knows what kind of village you're talking about? You must be joking and busy. Excuse me, doctor, please. I appreciate it. But you, you're a young man like me. Please, consider, consider my position. Please. I know that they're going to listen to you more than I. Please, doctor. Okay, okay. Young man, do you know any one of them? Oh, I don't know, but... I guess when we ask the village, you know, why, why don't you just walk over to the village yourself and find out that you go and meet them right for my life? Please oh, help me. You can do it for me, please. Nurse, come over here. Hurry up. Just in case that woman waits, make sure that nobody tells her what happened until I come back. I repeat, make sure. Okay? Now you take care. Come on, let's go. I am Dr. Chooks Ibe, mm. and this is Mike. Okay. Um, as a matter of fact, one of your villagers directed us to you, mm. and we hope you are uh, using us relation. Ah, I am Mr. Fox, his elder brother. Good. Yes. And what can I do for you? Sir, so, um, it's Sizuna. Yes. Uh, you see, as a matter of fact, uh, let me say it this way, your brother um, had an accident. Accident? It's all right, Where? It's all Where? right Is he wounded? No, sorry. What, what happened? I'm the one that hit You are the one that hit You are the one that hit You are the one that hit him. You are the one that hit him. If you kill this brother, you commit a I don't care. You know, and the police I don't want to know. You don't want to know. He killed my brother. He killed my brother. Take it easy. Take it easy. You hit my brother with your hands. And they're telling me, hey. Hey, it's okay. You are the one that hit my brother. Hey, it's okay. Hey, it's okay. You run a high block pressure. Hey. Calm down. Hey, calm down, sir. Hey, uh, calm down. Hey, mm. take it easy. Take it easy. Mm. Doctor, wait. He's the one that hit my brother. Uh, wait. Uh, 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 yes. No, sir. Hey, I'm sorry. Please, 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 I'm sorry.
He died. And they are holding jam down, sir. Oh, oh, oh. You can't have done high blood pressure now. Eh? You'll be hypersensing. Oh, oh, oh. oh, calm down. Oh, it's, 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 yes, but calm down. Take it like a man. Hey, calm hey, down. Hey, okay? Hey, calm down. Oh. Oh. It's a painful oh. loss, okay? Oh. It's a painful hey. loss. Like, oh, hey. yeah. Yeah. It's okay. Uh -huh. Okay, calm down. All right. Yeah. Yes. Isuna, calm down. Isuna, look at it. Isuna, look at it. Uju has succeeded. She has succeeded, Isuna. If only you had listened to me, this thing would not have happened to you, right. Isuna. And look at it. She has bewitched you. That woman has bewitched you, Isuna. Take it easy. Isuna! This is not the time to lament. This is the time to make a decision like a man. Take the bull by the okay? Look for the solution, okay? You can't afford to cry like a woman. Okay. You're a man, for God's sake. Yeah. Okay. Now, what do you intend to do? Because I can report this matter to the police. Oh, no, no, no. It won't yeah. get to that. Uh. Yeah, it won't get to that. All right. Yeah? And, uh, uh -huh. Sit down. It's part of why we came. Huh? Yeah, yes. Calm down. Uh -huh. Please, we can to discuss with you. Yes. So that you will help us call the king's man and let's plan for his burial. Sir, please, I am ready to do anything you ask me to do. Mm. Anything. Yes. Mm. Uh, how much do you want to give mm. so that I know how to talk to my king's men? Yes. Uh, actually, I was going to buy some materials for my new building before the incident. Mm -hmm. So, I have some money with me, sir. How much? Sir, I have up to 200,000 mm. for everything. Go and bring it. You give it to me so that I will know how to talk to my king's men. Uh, bring it is not your fault. Eh? It has happened. Uh, but listen, let me warn you. You don't have to come to this place again. Don't come to this uh, town again. Because if any of my kinsmen sees you, you will allow the others and they will lead you alive and they will burn your car. And you, don't come closer to any of my relations. Don't even try to visit us. Uh, um... Now, when do I get it? Do I follow you now to go and get it? No, uh, let me bring them. Is it my turn? Uh, go and bring it quick. Calm down, sir. You know, hey! the deal is done. The only brother I have. Don't worry. Look, hmm? doctor, you should have allowed me to at least touch this man with this thing. Yeah, what if he dies? Hey, yeah, he wouldn't die. The police will just he... come and arrest you. Don't oh, death. Oh, huh? oh, my doctor. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Oh, what just... the? God knows best. God knows I am, best. You know that I'm the only one left in this family. Oh. I am the only one left. That's why this thing is finished here. God knows best. Um, okay. okay. Uh, what is your time there? So it's after 12. Oh. Uh. Offer? Offer? <laughs> what is wrong with you, Offer? We've been here for, for, for more than 20 minutes waiting for you to, to, to tell us why you called us. And you are there discussing with Ika. Eh? What is the matter? My dear man, please, I am sorry. I never intended to waste your time. I wonder. I was just trying to sort out a few details with uh, Ika. Uh -huh. uh, we have had you. Offer. We have had you. Okay. Now tell us why you called us. Uh -huh. <clears throat> Something very terrible uh -huh. has happened. And ever since then, I have been speechless. What is it? Did anybody die? Yes. Tell them, tell them. Who died? Who died? Tell us. Is it the my brother? Is it my brother? What happened to him? Uh, uh, okay, what happened to Zuna? I said it. I said it. Zuna's wife was rushed to the hospital the next day for delivery. So I was sending money to them to assist them in their uh, needs there at the hospital. On getting to Kabi T Junction, I saw his cops and his bicycle by the push side. Hey! Uh, I inquired from people around and they told me that there was a vehicle that hit him there and ran away. Ran away? Yes. I collected the cops from my brother in Zunta and placed to the mortuary. Oh, 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 it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I want you to stop crying. It's okay. Hey. Hey. 
uh, our kinsmen. What do we do now? What do we do? Um, what can you do? I think uh, our knows the best. Mm -hmm. Let him tell us his plans. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Uh, in fact, I am suggesting that we should go to another court and place a cause on who did this to you now. No, no, no. My, my, my brothers, wait. Let us not pay evil with evil. Uh, we don't know who the person, that bastard, we don't know who he may be. He might be one of us, oh. our in laws, or somebody like that. You see? You see? You see? Uh, all we have to do is to make plans and bury my brother in the uh -huh. yes. mm -hmm. uh, uh, Offer? Eh? Uh, I guess, man. I think Offer is right. Yes. There's no need placing a course mm -hmm. on the heat and run driver. My kinsman, something touched my heart. What of the money for the burial? Uh, oh, oh, it's okay. Are you okay? Uh, yes, yes. 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 If you cry from morning to night, the issue will not come back again. Please. Uh, I think our voice is better for you to answer the question. Anyway, Isuta is my only brother. All I owe him is a defeated burial. Yes, uh, yes. I have budgeted the sum of 100,000 naira for that burial. Even if that money is not enough, I, I will sell some of my belongings in order to raise the money to bury him. That's all. Oh, even the binary. My kinsman. Offer has spoken well. Uh, uh. We are not going to leave it alone for him. Mm -hmm. Yes. Huh? Thank you. I think each and every one of us here must contribute something. Uh, yes. uh, what you said is true, but I want to suggest something. Go ahead. Um, Ofo, mm -hmm. I think the hundred thousand naira you budgeted is too small. So I suggest you should make it hundred and fifty thousand naira so that we others will know the next thing to do. Yes. Wow. That is why I say I will sell some of my belongings. When I have this hundred thousand, I will sell some other things and it might be up to fifty thousand more. That is what I'm saying. Okay. Uh, but if it is not up to, we'll leave it like that. Now, whatever you bring will add to it. Uh, I just need so you. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. I think we should go back home and come tomorrow. Mm. So that we should put heads together. If you are coming, we will make sure you, uh, you, you, you load your pocket with the money. Uh, no, yeah. Because tomorrow yeah. you will begin to talk. Bah, 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 bah. No, no, no. You're supposed to know who I am. Uh, it's not like that. What mm -hmm. mm -hmm. the offer? Uh, Please, you are uh, hold you. yourself. Stop crying. Thank you. Stop crying. Thank you, my brothers. Um, um, oh, uh, oh, 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 uh, be yourself, eh? Thank you. Stop crying. Uh -huh. To be okay, eh? Yes. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, are you not going with us? Uh, I want to stay with uh, you. Yeah. Yeah. I will you tell you some comfort. Okay. Uh, 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 so, I told you, wait to let them go. Now, yeah. Yeah. Suspect this thing. Yeah. They have all gone. I told you yes. how it was. Yeah, exactly. Uh, uh, what will happen is this: uh, you will come in the evening. I'll give you fifty thousand naira out of that money. Fifty thousand naira. Keep it to yourself. Don't pick out. Oh. Yeah, yeah, you know me. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. Eh? Uh, how I wish my only brother talk with her like this. <laughs> if you want, I can help you walk it. Out. You know Yes. Where did you go? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Go back. No. Please go back and don't follow me. No, it's not. Go and look after my son. It's not. Go back and look after your son. God will be your comforter. It's not. Go back. No. It's not. It's not. It's not. Where are you?
No! Where's my husband? Take it easy, just relax first. Where's my husband? husband? He went to collect something to the back. Don't tell me that. I had something yesterday morning and last night. You told me that he left for home this morning. Alright, relax. No! Relax. Remember your condition. No. And who is this man? He came here with gift yesterday. And today they with provisions. No, no, tell me that husband is. What is going on here? Madam, what is the problem? Go over here. From there. I want to see my husband. Your husband? Yes. What about your husband? This is the third day yes. I came here with him. Mm -hmm. And since then I've not set my eyes on him. Okay. And who is this man? I don't know this man from Adam. Don't concern yourself with him. Now listen to me. You want to know about her, your husband? I want to see my husband. Then calm yourself down, okay? Or else I won't talk. Okay, so now listen. Hmm? There's something I want you to realize. Just listen to doctor. Hmm? Hear me out. Hear me out. Okay? <laughs> see, if a man owns 10 flocks of sheep, and decides to take one to the market, nobody, I bet you nobody questions him. And that is the same way we are with God. He owns us all and decides to take us anytime he chooses, no matter the condition. I can't understand your parables, doctor. Listen to me. Eh? There's not much to my parables or whatever, but then these are facts of life. Calm down. Hmm? you get to know about your husband. I want to see my husband. You will see your husband, definitely. No, I want to see my husband. Please, please, please. It wasn't my intention. Take it easy. Please. It looks an accident that is unpredictable. Mm -hmm. Why are you leaning <laughs> up? Listen. Yes. Accident? Yes, an yes. accident. Accident? An accident. Accident? Where? Your husband had an accident. And unfortunately, he could not survive it. He didn't. Doctor. He didn't survive it. Now, Doctor. Doctor. Hold that down. Come on. Hold that down. Doctor. Hold that down. Doctor. Come on. Get a sedative. Get a sedative. Your husband gave for for the sum of three hundred thousand for your husband's burial. Yes. And he didn't tell you. He didn't tell me. Oh God! This man was bad. Instead, he said the money they used for my husband's burial that he brought it out from his own pocket. I will. So our folk can be this bad. So my dear, what do you intend to do? 
Eh? What do you want me to do? Tell me. My sister, I leave everything in the house of God. I can't do anything. Let him eat the money. So this man is bad, eh? I don't need your bloody seat. I suppose you understand that it's, it is with one day since your husband was buried. And you know as custom demands that all the money is realized during his burial, his property, even his farmland should be handed over to all the male surviving members of his family, which I am the only one. Now, go and get those things. That is why I am here. And that is why I have come. But to now your friend, this is unfair. And how do you want her to survive? Huh? Will you shut your mouth? Will you keep your mouth shut? Who are you? And is this, by the way, is this your husband's house? What is your business in this matter? What have you come to do in this very place? Don't let me get angry and tear you into shreds. Now, leave here before I get angry. Don't push me up. Leave here. Don't push me. Leave here, stand for you. I am coming, I'm coming. Go, leave. Don't come here again. I said don't come here again. If you come here again, I'll break your head. How will I feed my son if I keep you all these things? Eh? I don't care how you and your evil son survive. My concern is to get these things that I've listed for you. Otherwise, I will summon you before the council of elders of this town tomorrow. And you know what that means. You better comply immediately. Which you killed my brother and you think I'll just keep quiet and watch you like that. Nonsense. Get it. What is this? It's more than nine. What is this? I thought we made over 200,000 in this burial. Eh? And you are bringing me this. It is the only eh? money left with me. Maybe I will find somebody to buy this house. Because I will sell it and I realize my money back. Well, this is nothing. I invested over 100,000 in order to make gain out of this burial. And you are giving me this. Eh? Now, where are the wrappers that were used in this burial? Where are they? The rappers, I mean. You, I say, go and get them. You want my temper on you? You want to test my temper? When, when I lose my temper here, you will be sorry for it. It's just because we are wearing black. Get it? Where is his bicycle? Where is his bicycle? Where? This is like I thought he had something better than this. Eh? I thought he had something better than this. Anyway, I'll manage this. Nani, please. Nani, please. Don't do this to me. But don't fail to send for me. When any of uh, my friends who come to sympathize with me comes. I shall be coming from time to time to collect all the monies brought by mourners and sympathizers. No, you please. I suppose these are his goods. Yes, no, Aha, uh -huh, I'll collect them as well. No, you please. No, you please. I beg you, the name of God, please. Oh. Lie, please. You are wasting your time. It's none of my business. Lie, please. Lie, please. Lie. Um. Lie, this is our last hope. Lie. Um, get off and let me go. Hey, isn't that your dad watching your brother doing this to me? You want to fight me? No, please, lie, please, lie, please. You push me down is an abomination. You know that.
Good evening, brother. What are you doing in my house? Didn't I tell you that nothing on earth will bring us together as brother and sister again? Brother, please. Please, brother. I know I've disobeyed you people. But for, for God's sake, forgive and forget. Yes! I have forgiven and forgotten you for the past 12 years. I have told you not to marry Zuno that his brother Alpha does not like you in any way. You refuse my advice. Making me an object of caricature before the villagers. Would you please leave my house? Or you will regret ever coming to this place. Please, brother. Uncle, please. Uncle, please. Forgive my mother and her father. Remember, she's still your own blood sister. No matter what happened in the past, Uncle, please. Please, we need your help, Uncle. But I can't help you. I, I mean, I, I can't help you in any way. Would you? Leave my house! I said, leave my house! Leave my house! I said, leave my house! 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 Nonsense. I told you, you will not listen. Let me see you here again. I wish people like you will learn one or two lessons from it. Idiot. So what is it? What is it again I'm asking you? Yes. Please, we have come to tell you that Chibike, my son, has passed his common interest examination. What concerns me about that? Nani, please. We need your assistance. Hence, I have tried in his primary school. And this one will be difficult for me to handle again. Uju, well, did you hear that I run a charitable organization? Or that I award scholarship to people? Eh? Uncle, yes. it is not like that. It's just that you are last hope. And remember, Uncle, I'm your, I'm your brother's son. And as well as your own son, too. Hey. Uncle, Think about the future oh. now. Even you rat, you have been groomed to insult me in my own house. Now let me want to have you. You and your mother should stop coming to my house to disturb me. Is that clear? And let me not see your, you, in fact, your feet on this ground again, even your shadows. Nani, okay. Don't try it again for life. Okay, can you please give me my husband's bicycle so that I can sell it and take care of my son? Hey, hey. Oh, woman. You have said something that is against the tradition. This bicycle that was given to me by the tradition of our people is what we are calling your husband's bicycle. Oh, would you? So, you have grown so much to... You, you now want to challenge me, is it? No, it's not. Wait, I'll give it to you. I'll give you something. Oh, would you? No. Let me not see. Stand and take your husband's bicycle. Come. It is all right, Mama. It is all right, Mama. Stop crying. Let's go home. I believe our God is not dead. Mama, remember what you used to tell me, that in any condition we should keep glory to God. That is made a way when there is sister to be no way, Mama. You will make a way for us, Mama. Stop crying. She Stop crying. Stop crying. If only your father was alive. Mama, stop crying. Oh. Isona. Isona. It's okay. There is one thing I strongly believe, that one's destiny can never be changed, but can be defined by wicked ones, ma'am. Stand up, ma'am. What is it that will make you and yourself to be crying on the way like this? 
We are not crying that. You cannot tell me that. It is written all over your faces. Eh? Look at your eyes. Look at your nose. My dear. Your mother was so nice to us when our own mother died. She took us like her own children. Eh? And for that alone, your problem is mine. Hey, Lugo. Oh? Now, tell me. Auntie, my son Chibike passed his common interest examination. Mm -hmm. Where would Chibike? We met my elder brother, Uko. Mm -hmm. Instead, he chased us out of the house. <laughs> and we met Nanya for the worst happened. <laughs> It was our last hope. Stop crying, stop crying. Oh, your wife is here. It's alright. Huh? Ofo cannot be your last hope. Eh? He is not your God. He cannot be your last hope. Now come. Thank God. John, my brother, is still in the village. Let's go. I will talk to him. Huh? Ofo. Bye. Of course, cannot be a lot. Sorry, I have to take my time. Let's go. Well, sister, I've heard what you said about uh, Chubike. I will advise he stay here in the village with his mother and continue with his secondary education. However, I will take care of it. After which, I will now take him to the city to learn a trade, and I will settle him. Hey! Uncle! Ah! Uncle, thank you. God will bless you, Uncle. God will reward you. Okay, okay. Um, sister, I was going somewhere before you came in. Um, however, take this and see what you can pay him for his school fees, okay? Uh, why are we here on earth outside helping one another? John, my brother, I am not surprised. Eh? I know what you can do. I wish our mother is still alive. I'm on my way. Good behavior. Hmm? Respect your master and the wife. And remember to keep God first in everything you do. You can count on me, Mama. I will. You know, since you came into our lives, you have been our pillar of support. Of course. Eh? Please, if he does anything wrong, reprimand him. My God will bless you. Amen. Please say me well to your wife. Okay? I will, please. Chibike, when am I going to see you? <laughs> when will I see my son again? You're welcome. Thank you, my dear. How are you? Fine, thank you. So, how is everybody? Not too bad. They send their greetings. Ah. Uh, hey, honey. Who is he? You're always first. His name is Chubike. 
my second cousin. Though you don't know him, uh, he's from Achara village. I'll tell you more about him later on. Hmm? But please, since he has come to stay with us, take and treat him like your own blood brother. Okay? Honey, no problem. Chibike. Nancy, my wife. Oh, a good day, Aunt. Uh huh, Chibike, you're highly welcome to our home, eh? I know you must be tired now. Let's go inside so you eat, take your bath, and have some rest, okay? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> so, how has it been? My son Jimikem, I pray that God will retain the spirit of endurance, understanding, honesty, hard work, and obedience in you, so that you will grow to be an independent man one day, in Jesus' name. <laughs> How I wish that John and his wife can take you as their own blood brother. Oh, Chibike. God, I have so much in you. This is your battle. Let your will be done. I commit him into your hands. Do anything. Anything with him because I believe. I believe you. You are my God. You are my God. We have uh, 20 inches common television, which goes for 45,000 naira. 18 inches is being sold for 40, uh, 42,000. Yes. Then the 10 inches is for 25. Here, the DVD. The price is twenty-five thousand naira. Yes. The projector there. The selling price is five hundred and fifty. That one. Yes. The price tag is there. However, you can sell more than that. Okay. And uh, the refrigerator we have here. Yes. Right. Okay. Welcome, sir. Good morning. What do you what do you want? Um, How would you sell 21 inches TV uh, sharp brand? Uh, that's eight thousand naira, sir. That's eight. Mm. Is it not something of 27 or 28? Ah, uh, that. <laughs> Good soup. Na money maker. Good soup. Better money maker. Thanks and well now. Okay. Let me say 30. Okay, I know it now. You know Alright, let me give you 32. I will come out 2000 for you, sir. 2000 last. I will come out 2000 now. That is, give me 36. Alright, alright. Can I see it? Come, let me give you a seat. It's not yet back. Then you want me to be happy over this dish? No, this has to wait for now. Honey, up to that extent, it might just be the normal Lagos to job. I don't sense any danger. Oh. Good evening, sir. Good evening, Chubike. This is really quite unlike you. Huh? How do you decide to be so late? Just look at the time. I'm sorry, sir. Uh, I'm sorry for the lateness. Some of my customers came in from Abidjan barely 20 minutes after you left and we had to go to the warehouse because they wanted to buy large quantity. So, how many pieces did they buy? You are now excited. When I told you nothing was wrong, you didn't believe me. My dear. Well, they bought uh, 25 ceiling fans, 50 table fans, 21 inches and uh, 25 inches uh, TV sets. 15-15 each, and then the VCD plates. At what rate? 
apart from the VCD plates which I gave them at the, our flat rate, the others I gave them at our normal rate but I added one 1,000 naira on top of each. Okay, that's not too bad. It's okay. Now go in please, take your bath, eat your food, relax. I will discuss maybe by tomorrow, okay? Yes. Thank you, man. <sighs> Honey, there is nothing like home etiquette. Even without money. His mother must be a good woman. Uh, really, you need to see the woman. She's really nice. Um, one other thing is that my fellow traders are beginning to get jealous over this boy. Ah, that's the truth. What do you mean by that? Tibiki. Imagine you are four people. Tibiki, you came into this market before me, but today look at me. I do take my babes out to Mr. Big and Tantalizers for lunch. And you don't even know the color of these two places. Not to talk of having a girlfriend at your age. Wait, 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 wait. Is it because of these things you are saying that I'm a fuck up? Yeah. Yes, of course. But that is by the way. Sure. And I lent your organ and his wife travel to the village for better. Yes, they traveled yesterday. Yeah. TBK, you are now a big boy. And that's my friend. I want you to belong. Listen, there's this new nightclub in town. You know, by the name OG's Nightclub. I want us to go there tonight and catch some fun. Listen, there is quantum of babes there. They love sharks. You know, you meet and make new friends. As for the cash, you don't need to panic. I, Emeka, will take care of Bill. Clap for yourself. Yeah. Clap for yourself, Emeka. You're a good friend. A good friend indeed. Yes. yes. Listen to yourself. Emeka. Listen to what you're saying. Go to nightclub, carry girls, drink, smoke, make new friends. I thought you came here with a big business that two of us would do and make money. You're a bad lot. And if you don't mind, leave my shop now. TBK, are you asking me out of your shop? Yes, leave my shop this minute before I don't want people to hear my voice. I don't want people to hear my voice. Can I do my for God's sake? I'm only trying to brush you up. Yes, call me whatever you want. I don't care. Okay? I don't care. But leave my shop before you regret coming here. Ingrid. Yes, call me so, whatever you want. Thank you, CD. No, so chill. And I, I told you, I laughed at. Let me not see you here again. My happiness cannot be quantified as I am writing this letter to you. I was overwhelmed when I saw your picture and the letter you wrote to me. It was it was to me like, like a dream. As if it was not happening in this world at all. Eh? When your master and his wife came to, to our house and gave me your letter, your picture, two pieces of expensive wrapper, George with head tie, a bag of rice, a pair of shoes, and a handbag, and, and 5,000 naira cash, and told me that those things were from you. In fact, I cannot express my feelings. <laughs> I was so proud of you, Chibike, eh? especially when John's wife told me a lot of good things about you, and thanked me for your proper upbringing. Chibike, please. I am begging you in the name of God. Be aware of bad friends who might lead you to bad behavior. I am satisfied with what your master and the wife told me about you. Shibike, don't worry about me. Eh? I am perfectly well. Remain blessed, my dear. Eh, but I am still confused though. Where did you get those things you sent to me? I hope you have not been stealing your master's money. Please don't, oh. 
Hello, I'm yours beloved mother Uju. <laughs> but I, I didn't give them anything to give to my mother. Stop the murder. How much time we got, Gordon? We've got 51 minutes, 30 seconds. Are you cold? Can you understand me? Are you cold? Uncle? I've read the letter, but I don't understand it. The content is so confusing. What is confusing in the content, Jimmy? Well, sir. I didn't send my mother anything, but yes, yes, she's thanking me. you didn't. I did. I bought all those things for your mom. And my husband gave her the cash. She deserves that from us as a gift from you. Hey, uh, Auntie. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. No wonder she sounded so happy and she was thanking me. I didn't understand what it's she was saying. It's all right. It's all right. Um, you worked for her happiness, and so she should be happy. Chibike, Uncle, you are the source of her pride. Keep it up, okay? Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. No wonder she was thanking me. Yeah. Not understanding. <laughs> Or for you must tell me this time. Can you imagine this? This rogue, thief, this criminal, out of wickedness, threw a stick on the waist of my goat that was on leper, and the goat died. Or for you must tell me this time. You hey, must tell hey, me. Hey, calm down, calm down, uh, uh, calm down. Uh, Uche, what have you done this time? What have you done this time? I sent you to school. No pass. No result. I sent you to go and learn trade. Still no way. You could not do anything. What you do is go around the whole town, destroying things, spoiling people's property, and running into this very place for shelter. Uche, you are a wicked boy. Papa, don't call me a wicked boy, you. What do you Am mean? Am I as good as you now? What? After all, is it not your blood that runs in my face? My own blood? I am not sure. I have not investigated. And I am not even sure that I'm responsible for your pregnancy. Do you hear that? Oh, you are warning me you are pointing your finger at me you see you see you see like father like son also after your cross country race with your son you come and tell me for i go to okay i'm going i will see you at the market uh -huh. let's not forget john and the family will be coming home to celebrate the christmas yes. including chibike <laughs> <laughs> My own Chibike! <laughs> hey! Who gave you this beautiful news? It was uh, Patrick, Ozuama's son. Hey. He said John told him that all of them, including Chibike, will be coming home to celebrate the Christmas. Chibike! 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 So I'm going to see my Chibike with my two eyes! Chibike! I am going to be the happiest woman. That is life. I don't know how to be. I don't know what to do. I don't My Jimmy again. Hey! Chile again. My Jimmy again. My Jimmy again. Let me get you something. You don't if I give you your ranger. Hey! Jimmy again. You chill, Kadik, and you chill, Kadik. This visit by both of you to my house this evening. I hope all is well. Offer? Huh? All is done to well. Our kinsmen sent us to come and see you and talk with you. Over what? To talk with me over what? Offer? Uh -huh. A child that does not want his mother to sleep yeah. will never rest. Yes, that is true. We are talking about your criminal son, Uche. He was caught stealing somebody's coat. Yesterday was foul. The other day, chicken. The uh -huh. kinsmen said that this stealing must stop. And that is why they sent us. To come and tell you that in the next six months, if he stays in this village, or caught stealing, he'll be banished. Thank God we are your kinsmen. If not, something terrible would have happened. Yes. Let's go.
Uche. Uche. You will kill me in this house. You will kill me in this house. Bad boy. Wicked boy. Useless boy. My wife. Uh, How are my children? They're fine. Hey, yeah. I dropped them at my dad's Chibike, house. Chibike, please don't forget to leave evening, your belongings because I'm going to drop you immediately. Oh, God is wonderful. Okay, please. Prepare something for me to eat immediately I come back. You don't I'm have going to, I'm going to drop Chibike. Oh. That's all right. I am mean, tired. I'm there's no problem. You Come, need the rest, go. huh? Let's go. Let's go. Okay. I tell my duty to your mom, eh? I Don't push her down the way, hugging her. <laughs> Chibi, okay. I will see you later. Oh? Hey. Yeah. Hey. 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 Things Uncle John added some money, they gave them to you and made you believe I was the one who said, uh, uh, You know, oh. I can't tell my teeth with my tongue. I knew that you were not the one I, in that short period. No, <laughs> I, I was confused when I read your letter, so I was wondering until uh, Auntie Nancy now told me that they were the ones who played me that. Mm. <laughs> that shows you how much they love you. And our God is going to bless them and bond them, like I said. Amen. They will never lack. Amen. And you will never lack, my son. Amen. You know, you know, In Jesus' name we pray. <laughs> Chibike, 
John get somebody like you. Mm -hmm. Ha, Auntie. Mm -hmm. On this edge, impossible. Ah, yeah. CBK is different. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Don't <laughs> pretend. <laughs> anyway, I hope you don't mind. I want to go to Abba Village. Mm -hmm. There are some of my childhood friends I want to see. Mm -hmm. But I'll soon be back. Yes. Come again. Um, if you're going to Iba Village, just mind how you eat the salmon. Yeah. That is all. No, no, don't no, no, no. worry. I, I'll mind what I eat. Does okay. he need anybody to remind him? <laughs> uh, if he likes, let him go and eat anything. Until I made this food for you. Uh -uh. Yes. I made it specially for you, so hey. I want you to enjoy it. Hey. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Ah, thank you very much. <laughs> you cook the food. Yes. Chibi is a good cook. Well, as I was saying, one good turn they say deserves another. Chibi has made me a happy man. He's such a nice boy. Every home should wish to have as a son. Wonderful in all ramifications of life. Chibike, I am not settling you. Rather, I'm sending you to make a fantastic home for yourself. And I trust you will do it. About two weeks ago, we went to a bungalow, which I said belongs to my friend. Everything in that bungalow, including the building itself, belongs to you. The shop located at line B, which I showed you last time, is also yours. Honey, let me have that check with you. Here, a half a million for you to fall back on. I pray you use it judiciously. Thank you very much. Hey. I don't know. Thank you very much. I don't know. I don't know what to say. Thank you. What have I done to deserve all this, Uncle? Thank you. Chibike, you don't have to bother yourself. Huh? You worked for it and you merited it. John! Hey. You have done it as a man. In fact, you are a best setter. Thank you very much. Hey. Hey. Nah, you should have told me now so that I will invite the kinsmen. Uh, there was no need for that, madam. Um. One has got to be very careful these days in dealing with people. Hmm? However, let us take our drink. Yes, yes, yes. Hey! Uh, don't bend it! Don't, they don't bend this type of thing. Just, just hold it like that. Well, are you alright? Hey, you didn't travel abroad as you were planning. Okay. I had a phone number on my other, so he sent me back to the village. And since the other guy has been rusting away in the village. What kind of problem did you have with him that he had to send you back to the village? Besides, when did you return to Lagos? You know, the guy said that he had lost his money. It's a very special guy for me, it's a long story. What's this that I found in the village for me? 
can you imagine? Even for me to come back to Lagos last week was a nightmare. Yeah. In regards to my team friend. So what do you plan to do now? That's what I'm here to do. I came to see if you, know, you can spot me in your shop as a friend. While I hosted for customers, they want to as no staff elements. Um, you have to excuse me. I'm sorry. Uh, Come back later. Uh, okay, I'm not going to uh, See you then. Susan. Sit down. Thank you. You're welcome. So you're in this Lagos? Yes, I've been in Lagos for the past two years now. After my youth service. You mean you've been in this Lagos for the past two years? Mm -hmm. So what are you doing here? Well, you know what I went through during our secondary school days. Mm -hmm. So instead of being frustrated in the university, I went into trading. And today, by the grace of God, this is my shop. God for your life. You see, when things doesn't work out the way we plan it, it seems to some people that the world have come to an end. But you never relented. And now, see, you have made it. And now you can comfortably see yourself through in education to any level you wish. Oh, I thank God for you, GDP. So, what do you do now? And where are you staying? Um, well, um... I work as an accountant with Zenith Bank and presently I'm living with my uncle in First Stack Town. First Stack? Mm -hmm. You live in First Stack? Mm -hmm. So you and I have been staying in First Stack for the past two years and we don't even know. You stay in First Stack too? Yes, I live in First Stack too. Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Lagos. Lagos is a funny place. Indeed. So, um, will you visit me this Sunday? If I'm invited, how do I get the address? I live in 21 Road, uh -huh. exclusive, uh -huh. block 2, uh -huh. flat 5. Flat 5? Yes. There's a Suya man. I know the place, don't bother. A friend of mine stays close. There. Okay. Well, what brought you here? Um, I came to buy a more unique call, VCD, Samsung VCD. You really want me to believe that you're still single? If you like. So I become a liar now. No, I didn't mean it like that. I just wanted to be sure. Alright. Now that you're sure, why did you ask? I won't tell you right now. Why? When I take you out, I'll let you know. You take me out? Where? Yeah, that's this beautiful place I intend to take you to. Really? And where is the place? Don't be too curious. When we get there, you will know. Right? <laughs> I don't have any option. This food is delicious. Yeah. Thank you. Suzanne. Well, if anybody had told me I would never be in this position with you, I would be honest. Having you is like a dream. It may sound as if I'm flattering you, but I don't mean to flatter. It even sounds more like a flattering. Do you mean to tell me that it's your age and position that I don't have a job? I know it will be difficult for you to believe me, but I'm saying the truth. I don't have a girlfriend. You see, Susan, knowing where I come from, my background, and why I'm in Lagos, 
I decided a long time ago to keep to myself. That was until the day you walked into my shop. I started thinking about the old days when we were in school together. And everything changed. I believe you, dear. I, I, I know your point. I mean, I understand what you're trying to say, but Susan, I believe you are made for me. I must be open to you. I've never really liked any man in my life. Until that day, I met you at the show. And ever since, my life has never been the same. If love is to be quantified, I think my way cannot be. Same here, Susan. Same here. See, I'm neither a graduate like you, nor am I a woman. So, I can't really go for anything but the love I have. I love you, Susan. Sir. Good afternoon, my dear. Afternoon. You're welcome. Please sit down. Ah, Chibike. Chibike. The pity you missed the food. Ah, no problem. I'll prepare something for you. Ah, yeah. You're welcome. Hey, Mr. Chibike. <laughs> I know you don't have a sister. Who is she? Oh, I was actually coming to introduce her to you and Uncle. She's my fiance. Your what? Mm -hmm. My fiance. Where is she from? She's from Amike Village. Amike. Amike Village, yes. Which family? She's Chifobu's daughter. Her name is Susan. Chifobu? Yes. Obu's family? <laughs> so you are Obu's daughter? Congratulations! One give here! One day more! Ah! Dike! Congratulations! You're welcome! In fact, this really calls for celebration, my dear. Darling, please, a bottle of wine. Yes! Amara! Amarachi! Yes, Auntie! Come, please! Hmm! Can you be a bottle of wine, eh? Chibi Ken! And people used to say that when the head of the breadfruit is matured enough, it falls. And any tube of yam that grows above the surface of the earth, it does not fear the sun or the rain again. Once again, congratulations. Thank you, Uncle. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Susan, I will say that you're the luckiest woman on earth. To have Chibika as a husband. And I sleep. You're welcome. Thank you. I think I have to say to the success of marital life between Chibike and uh, Susan. Do us this very good journey. The journey that has to do with life and every other good thing in it. Chibike, you are welcome. <laughs> Yeah. Ah, we really have to toast.
idea. Wow. Yes. Thank you. Congratulations, my dear. Congratulations. Long life and prosperity. Wow. Hmm. Well, I'm very grateful to you, sir. Thank you very much. I'll be traveling to the village by weekend to see how the workmen are doing in my new house. Okay. And then I'll get a young boy to help me in my shop. That's a good idea. But before then, I have um, eight containers of 40 feet measure. That will be cleared at the wharf tomorrow. Four of them has been assigned to you. Sell them, make use of the gain, and return the cost price to me. <laughs> Don't fail to be at the office tomorrow to collect with the papers to that effect. I'll be there first thing in the morning, sir. I'll be there first thing in the morning, sir. Chibike, you made me the sunshine I am today. So whatever it takes, Marching towards this marital life. I give you my support. Carry go. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you very much, my dear. Thank you, You're sir. Welcome. Thank you. Right. Did you come with your car? Oh, yes, sir. Uh, it's parked right outside. Okay. Um, oh. Please, then. Let's see them all. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Thank you, my dear. Thank you very much. Sister Reed. That's Marfa. That's Marfa. She's so cantankerous. Yeah, talking about it. Ah, <laughs> Auntie. TBK. You're already here. TBK. Oh. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hey. Yes. Auntie. Well, it's good you're here because I was going to send for you. Yes, there is something important I want to discuss. I wanted to send for my uncle, Lofo. Yes. But, um,. She didn't agree. You see, I am now a man. A full grown man. I am doing well in my business. And God has blessed me financially. So, my next plan is to get married. Hey! 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 You want to get married? You didn't tell me now. You didn't tell me. Hey! So, is the legal you are in a big well, no, no, not in this village. But then, there was a girl I met in Lagos. Yes, she was my mate in the secondary school. In fact, you will know Chief Obu of Ameke uh, village. Yes, uh -huh. Obu. Uh -huh. She is his yes. first daughter, Susan. Hey. Hey. Nice man. Hey. He's a nice man now. Eh? And I, I will be glad. The girl comes from a, a very responsible home. I am going to be glad to have them as my in-laws. Um, Chibike, we give you our maximum support. Ma Thank, <laughs> you. Thank you. Uh, but uh, have you told your uncle John and his wife? Ah, uh, uh, auntie, what will I do that they won't be the first to know? I've already told them, and they've given me their full support. Yeah. Oh, in that case, you, uh, we are fully in support. Well, I'll leave you two to your discussion. Let me go to my building site there and see how the workmen are going. Okay. And this is your plan. I want to move. I'm not your specialty. He doesn't forget. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Ofo, we the entire community send for you and your useless son Uche. We sent Okadike. And okay, okay, to your house some time ago to give you the last warning about him. Now he has done the worst. What has he done? He raped in the maker's daughter last night. Are you sure? I am sure. <laughs> He's enough now. This time around, we will not take it anymore. Good. Uh, my fellow elders, I greet you all. As no one has agreed, on a two hour, we go see two for an hour. Of your one year, there's no need for us to waste much of our time here. 
If you people don't have other things to do, how you can decay have? So, what do we do to this bastard? Unyuchi. Ndiche, nyenu mungu wana akam. Ndiche, nyenu mungu wana akam. Ndiche, nyenu I suggest that we should allow this poor boy to talk first before we can know what to do. Ego has shut up. If you don't know what you are saying, shut up. Ego has shut up. Shut up. You want to base of the same feather. I thought we resolved something in our last meeting. Before you send I and Okadike to the first house. Yes. Without wasting much time. This What we said we shall do, we must do. Yes, right. Right. Uh, what is going on here? I mean, what is happening? They have banished your brother Uche because, according to them, that he was caught last night when he raped a girl. Did you say rape? That's what they said. Banished? Lawyer! What can I do for one? Well, um, I don't know. what to say. I'm really shocked and surprised. But I can understand your anger and you know your bitterness about this abominable act. You see, what Uche did, if indeed it's true, is wrong. It's an abomination. Good. That means our land has been desecrated. But I want to plead on his behalf. Please, temper justice with mercy. I promise you, I'll take him from this village to Lagos. I know you must require some things to cleanse the land. So tell me what it will cost for the ceremonies to be performed and uh, the land to be cleansed. How much will it cost? Oh, wait. Just wait. Give me one minute. You want to take him to Lagos? Oh, yeah, you want to take him to Lagos? Well, like I was saying, I want to take Uche with me to Lagos. And I promise you, he will not see this village again until he has changed. But then you will need some money for materials to cleanse the land. So I am willingly donating the sum of 50,000 naira for you to cleanse the land. This is the money. Your promise satisfies me. You should have given that money to me. Promise. Yes. Promise them to take Uchema to the city. Yes. How can? Well, I have heard all you said. And I fully understand you. You've told me his father's wickedness before. And some of his practices I have also seen. But then, Mama, you don't pay evil with evil. Do you know why God has left us alive till today? Do you know? It's not that we're better than others. It's by His grace. So, uh, let me take Uche with me to Lagos. And see if I can reform him. Then we leave the rest to God. Because I know that God is in control. If you say so. Okay. Huh? Who am I to argue? But you just have to be careful with that boy. How do you say it now? You get me? Eh? The rejected stone has now become the base pillar of the house. I'm really very sorry for every wicked act of mine towards you people. Please forgive me. 
uh, <clears throat> and create in your heart a soft spot for me and take me in today as your husband please forgive me Hey, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I'm forgiving you. But you know it's not easy to forget. Yeah? You're my husband now. Uh, th thank you. What can I say? Mama, thank you. Thank you for forgiving him. Mm -hmm. Uncle, mm -hmm. you don't have to worry. Uh, thank you. you. Relax your mind. Mm -hmm. Would you thank you immensely, eh? Chubike, I don't know what to say, but God will bless you. And will reward you greatly. Hmm? Amen. Uche, come. Chubike, this is your brother. The only brother you have. Please, take good care of him. Eh? Uh, I know that God will always be with two of you in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, um... Lagos is a far place and yeah. um, uh -huh. we need to start moving as quickly as possible. Yeah. So Uche, go and get your things, put them in the car so that we can start going. Mm. Mm. Yes. The money I left in the bedroom beside drum. Who took it? But I, I didn't take any money. If I slapped it, some people said they saw you in the bedroom down the road buying drinks and chicken for some amenities around here. And you say you don't know. If I bring that money right now. What is happening here? What is it? Can you imagine this, this, this idiot went into our bedroom, took 20,000 naira from the bedside drawer, and now he's denying it. 20 what? 20,000 naira. Can you imagine? Honey, are you sure? How can you ask me if I am sure? Who else in this house will, will do that kind of thing with him? Who else? Uche, if you don't give me that money, by the time I finish with you, your father will not recognize you. I'm up there. Why did you steal your father's money? You want to liquidate him? He brought you to Lagos, provides you with everything that you need. Why do you want to pay him back by stealing his money? Are you sure you're not possessed? Auntie, I'm sorry. I won't do it again. I'm sorry. It's alright. Yeah, I'll apologize to me. And I'm sorry. I won't do it again. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Alright. You won't do it again. I promise. And tomorrow I'll take him to see our pastor. Pastor? You think this is a problem for pastors to solve? I think he's going to solve it once and for all. And then you call me on them also. It's alright. Just don't do it. Don't do it again, okay? Arise, O oh Lord, let the enemy be scattered. Arise, O oh Lord, let the enemy be destroyed. Arise, O oh Lord, let the enemy be scattered. Arise, arise. My God, follow in the name of Jesus. You are a mighty man of God. You have done greater things to God. Today you will do a wonderful thing in his life. King of glory in his life, although there are a lot of spirits warring and trying to destroy him. He said, The devil has gone into him a lot to destroy and to scatter and to kill. The spirit of, of still in the God, the spirit of rape, the spirit of destruction. And it has gone into this young man of God to destroy him. But he said, O oh God, there has never been a God your desire. Because your thoughts over him, O oh God, is of good, not of evil. Because what thou hast made him in your own image, he will do a great job in his life, those hours. Right now, Father, I want to shine into him 
the Spirit of God. The Spirit of God of deliverance. May your holy name be exalted. Yes. For thou hast delivered me. In the mighty name of Jesus, our Lord. Amen. Mathematicians, I'm now back off. <laughs> Darling, you're back. But welcome. And then how are you? I'm sure your trip was fine. Oh, very successful. I got to the house first. Your mother, your uncle were very excited. Mm. My parents were all over the place announcing the traditional wedding to anybody that cares to listen. What do you expect? That card was even useless. Who <laughs> <laughs> just that said he was coming? Attend his only brother's traditional marriage. Abby? Who else, if not him? Abby? Uche, you heard what she said. Your father is expecting to see you, so you have to get your things ready. You're traveling with us, okay? My dear, I'm sure you're tired. Very tired. So, so go in and get fresh in, huh? Get something. Now, so join us. Yes. The TV sets, how many? So. Good morning, Abby. Good morning, Abby. Good morning. Uche, my son, how is business? Papa, business has been so wonderful. God has blessed Chibike. In fact, Papa, Chibike is now in big money. Big money, Papa. Mm. I tell you, big money. Mm. I hope you know about that business. You know everything about that business. How do you mean, Papa? I mean, I hope you know how to buy and sell goods. About that business. That's what I mean by the business. Oh, is by that what everything. you mean? Yes. <laughs> Papa, GBK taught me everything about that business. Good. In fact, he and his wife, Susan, have been so good to me. Mm. In fact, they have even turned me to a born again Christian. Mm. Can't you see? My life has changed for the better. Mm -hmm. Papa, I give glory to God. No, I thank I thank him also. Uh, that's very good. Papa, I want to go and sleep now so that I can wake up early tomorrow morning and prepare for the traditional marriage. Okay. Good night, son. Chibrike yeah. is now rich. He's in wealth. He's the only son. I think I will have to eliminate him so that my son, I'll eliminate him and his wife. Yes, so that my son will inherit his wealth. <laughs>
a good morning. That's a good morning. Uche, where are you coming from this morning? I want to return those crates we used to buy drinks yesterday. Oh, oh that's very wonderful. nice. Can you go back? Go and get me uh, one glass from the table there. Eh? Uh huh. Um. Uh -huh. Take this. You drink and then give to your wife. Hmm? Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh yes. Uh -huh. Take this. Uncle, uh, we will drink, but let us pray first. Ah. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh yes. Yeah. Let us close our eyes. Uh -huh. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for keeping us alive and well. We thank you for yesterday. Our traditional marriage went very well. Yeah. Everything was smooth. There was no problem. Mm -hmm. Nobody complained about anything. There was no rain to disturb the event. Wow. We thank you that today we are now fully married traditionally. We have news that all our guests have returned home safely. Mm -hmm. We thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. We thank you for our uncle who has invited us here today to thank us for yesterday and give us drinks. Bless him in Jesus' name. Amen. Bless his son Uche. Very soon he will be free in the trading business to set up his own and become a full-fledged man. Bam. Father, we ask that you bless our own marriage too. That our marriage will be an example to all. All this we ask through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Oh, wow. Uh -huh. mm. Mm. Baba, how is the drink? Oh, it's wonderful. Yeah. This is great. You know, Uncle, yeah. Uncle gets the best. Oh, yes. Mm. Mm. Nice drink. Yes. Yeah. <coughs> Uncle, we have to be on our way because uh, we want to visit a few people before we start going. That's right. But I will come back. In the evening to see you. All right. <laughs> oh, thank you. Okay. Okay. Bye -bye. okay. Bye -bye. okay. Bye -bye. What is it? Hey. Uncle, what is it? Oh, my stomach. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. This boy is dying here. Oh. Hey. Somebody help me. Oh. Who's there? Hey, who is there? 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 Papa, what, what, please, what yeah. is it? Ah! Okay, before, Papa, he invited us and, and gave us drinks. We drank our own, he drank his own, and yeah. as we were going, we heard him screaming. Drinks? Uh, uh, yes, uh, look at the drinks here. Uh, I don't know. Uh, is it right? Papa, let's take Papa? him. Papa? Uh, help us, let's take him to hospital. Uh, no, there is no need. Uh, uh, to be get. Ah! Uh, I poisoned the drink they gave to you and your wife. Because I wanted to kill you and your wife, but I didn't know how the the drink was reversed, and I took it. I, I wanted my son to inherit your wealth when you die. Hey, let's take you inside. Look at you. Remove your hand. Allow him to confess all. To be gay. So please forgive me. It was I who killed your father. I manipulated that accident that took his life. Ah! Hey! Hey! I must speak up. Hey! 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 I never wanted him to marry a mother. Hey! Because I hated that woman badly. Hey! 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 Uche, Uche, my son, please obey your master Chibike. He's the only brother you have in this world. Try not to pay his good deeds to you with any evil at all. Ding bana bana aru. Go and meet him. Now we see him.
Tomorrow.